Hello everyone, and welcome back to Uprising AI. In this video, we're diving deep into Google's groundbreaking Search Generative Experience Initiative, SGE. Google has recently unveiled a remarkable feature that allows users to create images directly from the search bar using text prompts. This feature is part of the Search Generative Experience, SGE initiative, designed to boost creativity in search queries. Powered by Imogen, a text image diffusion model, SGE excels at producing realistic images by deeply understanding textual input. Imogen operates within Google's Lambda, a powerful language model proficient in handling natural conversational language. What's more, SGE is now available in over 100 languages, making it accessible for users worldwide. With SGE, you have the freedom to choose the aspect ratio of your generated images, whether it's square, portrait, or landscape, and to select from a variety of image styles, including 3D, oil painting, or cartoon. For instance, let's say you want to create an image of a mystical floating city in a desert with buildings made of crystal. Simply type in your description and hit enter. The resulting image showcases how effectively the AI model comprehends your input, generating a captivating city with crystal structures emerging from a serene desert. But the power of SGE doesn't stop there. You can easily make alterations to your image. Want to add a magical waterfall cascading from one of the crystal towers? Or perhaps you'd like to change the time of day to twilight. It's a breeze. Just modify your query, and you'll get the image you envision. SGE offers incredible control and flexibility in image generation, with your choice of words determining the outcome. The AI model endeavors to create an image that aligns with your description. Now, how does SGE compare to other AI tools for image creation? There are various tools out there, like Microsoft's Bing Image Creator with DALI 3, Mid Journey with Stable Diffusion, Crayon with DALI, Mini Night Cafe with Dream by Wombo. Each of these tools has its unique strengths and weaknesses. For instance, Bing's Image Creator is user-friendly and allows easy image modifications. Midjourney produces high-quality images and supports multiple languages. Crayon is quick and easy to use, and you can download images at no cost. Night Cafe adds a fun touch by animating images with music, and DALI boasts a robust model capable of tackling complex prompts. However, SGE has its advantages over these tools. Firstly, it seamlessly integrates into Google Search, eliminating the need for a separate app or website. You can use it by simply typing your query into your browser as usual. Secondly, SGE utilizes Imogen, a sophisticated text-to-image diffusion model that creates lifelike images with a profound understanding of language. Imogen learns from a vast corpus of text and images available online, including Google search results, making it well-informed. SGE can process multimodal queries, enabling you to combine text, images, and emojis for detailed and realistic images. Furthermore, SGE allows users to work with BARD, Google's AI chatbot, enabling image generation while conversing with BARD. Moreover, you can request BARD's assistance in drafting written content within SGE. For example, you can ask BARD to create an article on a specific topic while providing relevant images. This combination of BARD and SGE is a valuable resource for content creators, writers, or students seeking inspiration. However, there are important things to know before using SGE. Firstly, SGE is currently in its experimental phase, which means it may have some bugs or errors. The AI may not always fully understand your request or create the exact image you have in mind. Nevertheless, it continues to improve with ongoing feedback and data. Secondly, SGE has measures in place to prevent misuse. It won't create images that are harmful, offensive, or misleading. Additionally, it won't generate realistic images of people's faces or notable individuals without permission to safeguard privacy and prevent the spread of false information. Thirdly, SGE includes features for labeling and watermarking to promote transparency and accountability. You can view the text prompt used to create the image by hovering over or clicking on it. Lastly, SGE is intended for use by individuals aged 18 or older, as some of the content it generates might not be suitable for younger users and may require parental supervision. Understanding these points will guide you as you navigate the exciting world of SGE. We hope this video has provided you with valuable insights into this cutting-edge AI technology. If you found it informative, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe, and share your thoughts on SGE in the comments below. Thank you for joining us on Uprising AI, and stay tuned for more AI wonders in the future.